All right, hey guys, Mini Kiwi Nine here, back with another quick video, um, and this one's an exciting one. I've been waiting for a while uh, for this one. Raids are officially live. Super sick, uh, super fun to see. Um, you can view all the information on the Discord, which I will just quickly pull over. So this is from uh, Buff Daddy here. <clears throat> The uh, most important thing here is the rewards. Uh, you can get a weapon, two to five stars. You can get what's junk, uh, which is essentially what you can just reforge uh, and to then create dust. So basically just dust, but it can vary on the type of dust you get. Um, and then again, you can get dust. So a lot of dust, you're always getting experience, assuming that you win. And then there's a possible secret key loot box and then a trinket. Uh, but the trinket, there's only one that you'll be getting. Um, there's not. It's not going to cost any skill. It, it does lock up. Uh, it does cost 200 stam and 20 durability for the weapon. And my understanding is that you can only use one weapon per character. I've not done the, done uh, put a character in yet, so we're going to try it out. Hopefully there's no bugs or anything. Um, so we'll select my level 41 character. We'll do my three-star weapon that I have and sign up. So joining will cost 12 hours of stam. Let's sign up. We're going to have to verify here. Confirm. So the weapon gives us a multiplier, and so obviously that kind of depends on the weapon you get. Here you can see the experience that you get, and now we are added to the raiders. So, I mean, we have so many raiders in here, so I don't think there's going to be any problems with beating the enemy. Um, here in my time, it will be done at midnight, uh, just, just right around midnight. So I will pause this video until until midnight in the meantime just quickly you know click like click subscribe i'm going to keep doing more crypto blades content i know it's been a little slow i just didn't bother giving an update while uh, we're just not really making any money i wasn't even doing the battles personally i was just waiting for this so super hyped uh, to, to get this going um and yeah i'll see you in just a sec all right and we are now just past midnight as you can see the next raid has started versus hodl lord now one thing to notice um down here is that it is now costing skills so the first one they gave us for free this one now they are looking like they're wanting us to cost uh, just a titch um to sign up now it well it says i say just a titch but it looks like it's like trying to say like that much skill but my understanding is point one uh, so 0 0.10 and all these decimal uh, numbers are following, but ultimately 0 0.1 skill in order to raid. So is it going to be worth it? Yes or no? We're going to go ahead and hit claim rewards and find out. Hopefully we get a good drop. We'll see. Let's go. I don't even have a five-star weapon yet, so it would be super sick to get one of those, but can't be too hopeful. Okay, so we just confirmed the transaction. Hopefully, I mean, that's my first time trying it out here, so see how it's going i know i know what we need we need hit the like button and that will give me the five star come on i'm sure it'll work all right let's give it a refresh see what happens hmm. all right so now the claim reward button is not there so did it just go into if i go into my blacksmith I guess let's take a look I don't think any of these are new weapons, because yeah, I've had all, I had all these before. So maybe I got dust, dust storage. Doesn't look like I got dust. I think I have I I've forged some or reforged some weapons and got dust on one of my other accounts. But I didn't do raids on the other accounts yet. Hmm. Well, it hasn't popped up yet, so I guess we'll finish this video once I get my reward. I'll ask some questions in the Discord. And you can do that as well. It's a great feature. And all right, guys, good morning. I just barely woke up. I came in here and refreshed, and it looks like nothing dropped for me this time. So my... My character got 240 experience, uh, but aside from that, uh, looks like I bricked out, which is pretty unfortunate, uh, considering the amount of exchanges of gas I had to pay, and then to not get any loot. Uh, 
definitely kind of kills the motivation to want to do another one, especially considering they are now going to cost point one skill, which is, um, you know, about five bucks, right? Yeah, because right now I actually just pulled up the price, and surprisingly, the skill actually went up in price. Um, we're at fifty two dollars now, so I mean, it's good that it's going up. Um, it actually might be profitable to do battles, uh, to do combat now. Let me actually just take a look if I go to blacksmith with my this weapon I still can't use um, but if we do earnings calculator for 200 stam okay we're almost break even um, with a two star weapon level 41 character I'm sure if we use this three star yeah not really a change so I mean we're getting closer to maybe making a little bit of money just doing the battles but for now looks like I'm personally gonna be holding off I mean you're paying a lot of gas so you would have to get a decent reward in order to make that worth it and 240 experience will not be that decent reward but hey you know we'll we'll see how it goes in the future um, I'm looking at other NFT games I might do a Splinterlands overview uh, the game is really complex uh, of course, you know, there's Alluvium, there's Star Atlas that are coming out, which those two just seem super hype, uh, lots of potential there. Uh, but, you know, we'll, ha we'll have to see what's going on. Thank you guys again for, for watching. More, more content coming. Uh, stay tuned.